Hello my friends! So it's been a long time since I did a scroll cell project. So I decided to do a scroll cell vase. And this is a lovely pattern designed by Steve Good. And you can find a link to this pattern at his blog the scroll cell workshop .blogspot.com. So usually I'm not a big fan of scroll cell projects made out of plywood. But somehow I think a plywood edge might look nice on a vase. So I'm going to make a vase out of plywood. And for the front of the vase I like to use this beautiful piece of veneer. So much for the preparation and now I'm going to sit down in front of my scroll saw and start scrolling. Now I think this might be a little boring to watch, but since I know how much you guys like to listen to music in woodworking videos, get yourself a drink or something, lean back and enjoy some really nice royalty free music from the YouTube audio library while I make some sawdust. The original pattern has a very nice design on the front of the vase. But I don't think this works well with the grain of the veneer. So I think I go with a simpler pattern. I'm sealing the front of the vase with lacquer, because I'd like to stain the vase, but primarily I'd like to stain the plywood and not the veneer. So I hope that by pre-finishing the veneer, I prevent the veneer from getting stained as well. And now I glue all the pieces together.
Well, there you go. Obviously, it's not perfect, but that was to be expected. And it's no problem, because I can fix that with sanding. To round over the edges I could use a router, but with plywood and veneer I'm afraid of tear out. So I round over the edges using sandpaper. I stain the vase with an oil stain made of boiled linseed oil and burnt umber pigments. After the oil stain has cured for a couple of days, I apply a few coats of spray lacquer. Well, and there it is, a beautiful scroll saw vase. I hope you like it as much as I do. <laughs> Thank you for watching. <laughs>